You know, yesterday I was complaining about missing Seattle. And today it's storming like crazy. And I like it. I, I, I do kind of miss this kind of weather, even as much as I cursed it back in Seattle. Just not every day. Just not every day. I need, I need my sunlight. And I do kind of miss this kind of weather now looking back at it. But a good thing is that this is a one or two day occasion here in Phoenix. I, uh, I'm fortunate I'm out of Seattle. I, I heard there were many feet of snow over there. And if I were in Seattle today, I'd probably be living out of my car. Right now I come out to my car to enjoy the weather, right? So that was good. I had a bad dream last night, though. And I know why I had the dream. I dreamt that it had been years and years later. I was still making bismuth art, and now bismuth was worth $100, $200 an ounce, which is what I predict it will be. There isn't much room for many people to be doing what I'm doing with uh, with bismuth. Let me see if I can get something I recently made. Here's another one of those... Uh, Who does? So there isn't much room for many people to be doing what I'm doing, right? That's what a lot of people don't get. They 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 think it's uh, very cool, and um, and they see me ordering 50 pounds, 100 pounds, 200 pounds sometimes. If even a, a, a small group of people start doing this like even if all of my subscribers started doing this kaboom um, that's how small the bismuth this isn't like silver where you could get you could get a lot of followers right if if every one of peter shit's subscribers bought a few hundred ounces of silver it would hardly dent the market right but anyway so in my dream it had been years and years later and now uh uh, I was becoming popular, and now silver was worth a hundred bucks an ounce. And so uh, my uh, ex-girlfriend decides to sue me because uh, she claimed that one of the art pieces I made was her inspiration, and uh, she was suing me for it. And uh, I had other things to do, so I just handed it off to her. But it just goes to show that in my waking life, a lot of times I'm a pushover for stuff like that, and I leave behind a trail of toxic relationships which is why i left seattle in the first place and then i woke up today and it was raining and it, 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 just the uh, whole complex of the the, the dream and, and the, the 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 weather just reminded me of where i was um, in the past now a big problem the reason for the toxic relationship is that i don't really feel a lot of romance i do want a life partner but i don't want the romance you guys may have remembered three years ago when I had a girlfriend. I was very annoyed that uh, a lot of times I didn't have time to go out to stargaze by myself, to go to a computer game conference, to make bismuth art. If I had a girlfriend today, that would be a big drag, right? The, the bismuth art. Uh, and uh, I was just thinking about where I want, wanted to travel next year and I got a big dilemma going on because I want to go back to Seattle. I miss a lot of people that I knew at the board game meetup that I was uh, at over there. I also want to, uh, well, there's this one celebrity who uh, she talks to me a lot and we were talking about uh, me uh, visiting her and she might even have um, a, 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 well, a, a very progressive kind of wedding ceremony I want to see. And then I also want to fit in with my colleagues, right? Part of the reason my boss gives me flack about going on vacation is that I go on all these unconventional vacations, unconventional events. So so in order to appease them, I, I want to go to Disney World at some point, or maybe Cancun, and or, or perhaps Las Vegas. Although I did try Las Vegas, I didn't really like it. So either Disney or Cancun at some point. And then, um, so... I'm kind of at a loss on what to do first and when to do it. Obviously, this is not the best time of the year to go to to Seattle anyway, and perhaps not um, to, uh, to to visit my uh, my celebrity friend. So we'll have to see. Anyway, but um, that will be my goal next year to 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 uh, 
go on a trip that the rest of my colleagues can accept me for. I think Disney will probably be the easiest one to do. Um, and um, try to try to clean up some of the toxicity in my life and perhaps meet somebody who is auto romantic just like myself so we won't have that falling out at the end and have our own space.